John Wick. He is the man who killed the boogeyman. Who killed the boogeyman. And then boogeyman turned into nothing. All right, so this is John Wick. Come on, focus, bullshit camera, focus. That's John Wick, 4K. John Weekend. Let's call him the John Weekend. It's John Wick. 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 Don't be a dick. Because you know you're John Wick. All right, this is John Wick. Obviously, everyone has seen this movie. This movie sells out like freaking hotcakes. I already saw the sequel. Man, if you think the first one was great, wait till you see the sequel, man. The sequel was just like John Wick on steroids, man. It was an all-out action, man. No sequel, it's where he definitely gets back to what he did in the past. Like, you know, he lost his family now. He doesn't have a wife, so he lost his dog. But he got another one. But now he goes to Italy. He goes in to fucking work for the uh, Illuminati again. Get the job done. <laughs> anyway, uh, the sequel is awesome. This is going to be unboxing of uh, 4K Ultra HD John Wick. So let's go and let's unbox it, shall we? In about one second. Okay, so this is the... When you take the cover off, take the sleeve off, and then you get the uh, the jacket case right here. And when you open it, there's two movies in there. You know, you got the uh, the Blu-ray edition, and then you got the uh, 4K Ultra HD edition, which is the only edition I care about. But it's cool that you also get a Blu-ray for the amount of money you. I mean, why would you spend money on the Blu-ray when you can get? 4k with the blu-ray so it's like it's a good deal for, for the one price for one low price you get the uh, benefit of the boat and I only pay like $17 on this thing this normally is gonna be $29 but while the movie is still you, I think you got until tomorrow to get it for $17 if you're lucky man if you're lucky enough to find it I only find one copy by by pure luck because this is the fastest selling uh, 4k UHD movie I would say since Fast and the Furious, the first one, the first Fast and the Furious DVD when it was released and Saving Private Ryan, uh, this one is on the top three of the fastest selling uh, 4K UHD Blu-rays. Well, here's the deal, man. This is how I'm going to do it. Let me show you the back. There's the back right there. It has the uh, 4K Ultra HD. Uh, it lets you know what you're going to need to watch the movie and all that goodies. Um, the one thing that what I'm going to do in the next few minutes I'm going to try to show you guys a some demonstration some clips of the movie what I'm going to do is I'm going to turn the sound off totally so you guys won't be able to hear anything I'm just going to commentate and put some of my own sound effects with my own voice because if I put any kind of uh, audio, I will get it automatically flagged, okay? And keep in mind, I'm not monetizing this video. I'm not profiting from this video. All the proceeds will go to whoever's the, uh, I don't know, let me see, uh, Summit. Summit Entertainment and the Thunder Road, it goes to them. All the proceeds goes to Summit Entertainment, uh, which is a studio that made a movie. It goes to them, okay? I'm just using a fair use, which is out there on the statue low. I think we still have that statue low, don't we? I think we still do. I don't even know, man, what freaking laws do we even have? With everything that's been going on lately, I don't even know what the fuck we have anymore, man. I don't even know who's in charge. Is anybody in charge anymore? Really? Is anybody fucking in charge anymore? I still have a fucking clown stealing my videos and he hasn't been taken down. So I don't know, maybe there are no fucking laws anymore in place. But anyway, it's a fucking fair use, okay? So kiss my ass, it's a fucking fair use. There. At least, to my knowledge. So what I'm gonna do next is I'm gonna show a few clips, turn the sound down 
so you guys can watch it. And remember, it's fair use. I'm not profiting any fucking money from this shit. I'm just showing it to you. All right, so let's get back to a uh, couple of scenes in the movie really quick so you guys can see how it looks, all right? All right, so that's the menu. That's the menu of the film. In the beginning, when you pop the disc in, that's what you get. Looks pretty flashy. Uh, it looks pretty good. Let me turn the lights off. The reason I'm doing it in the dark, because I want you guys to see it while, you know, you get better picture observance when I am having all the lights turned off in this room. What I mean by the observance is you get better viewing when everything is turned off, just like in the movie theater. All right, so let's uh, check a couple of scenes really quick. We'll go to the nightclub scene, uh, do that really quick, and I'll do some sound effects, you know, like... Baba Booey, he was a boogeyman that killed the boogeyman, became another boogeyman and ate the booger. All right, and spilled the beans, and then now he's working for Illuminati. That's John Wick. All right, enough of the fucking goofing around. Okay, so this is a nightclub scene, so let's go watch it. Uh, I can tell you right away that green right here, that green, and on the both side of the building, and that red, that those two neon lights... Uh, that lit up the one side green and the other side green looks fantastic on HDR. And that red LED in the middle looks fucking fantastic. I know you guys cannot, you can't fucking see it on this YouTube channel, okay? I get it. But trust me, it looks fucking great on Samsung KS8000. You know why it looks so fucking great? Because it's 10-bit color TV with white color gamut and 1000 peak brightness nits okay they look like tits but they're 1000 peak brightness nits all right let's stop fucking around this video is already going nowhere i'm sound like asshole today i'm pissed dude today i'm just like fucking on a roll i'm like bane like oh you're going to i was like whatever i don't want to do the bane voice here we go let's start the shit Let's do some background music. Here we go. 